All right, so once you have finished your embroideries, um, wooden hoops, you're gonna have this funky looking back. And I mean, if you wanna leave it and let them just hang like this, that's totally on option. But how I finished the backs of my embroidery was I used felt and you've been supplied with enough felt for all of your designs. So I'm just gonna do a quick tutorial of how this would work. So I'm going to trace out my design. You can use a heat erasable pen if you have one, um, but this also isn't something that should affect the quality of how you've done it. But we're tracing out our designs and you're not gonna trace the hanger at the top. So in this case, I'm just gonna do a little um, extra and cover that. And then for this, I'm actually going to cut kind of on the inside of this line. Um, I don't, I want it to be slightly smaller than my actual ornament so that you don't see all of the felt from the front. Two options, some of the cool things that I saw last year that I really enjoyed was I loved that someone wrote a little message on the back of their ornaments. So they wrote 2020, well, last year it was 2022. All right, now for the back here, after they drew their little message, which I think is really cute, adding who stitched it or what year it was, or um, you could write like a little message of your year, what happened that year or something cool like that. Um, and then I saw one person who did... Um, a little stitch around the edge, um, a blanket stitch around the edge, which I thought was very cute. So I'm gonna just show you quickly. So they kind of, they stitched, oops, my bad. I didn't do that right. They stitched a blanket stitch around the edge of all of their felt. So you're gonna come up underneath, I'm not great at the blanket stitch yet, and then through as they go around. So you kind of got to hold your, um, so you're coming through, and then before you close that loop, you kind of do a stitch around. So they blanket stitched the edge and then when they laid it on top, it had a decorative edge along the back. And then they um, glued it down. So for the, the gluing down process, like obviously you can use a glue gun or any kind of glue that works for you. I think even a glue stick might work, um, but whatever you choose is the option that will work for you. Um, I used a glue gun because I had one, but. And then that's your finished look. So those are some options. You can just glue down the felt with none of the extras, or you can um, do something cute like that blanket stitch, which obviously if you're gonna do the blanket stitch, I would be sure to trim it quite a bit because that may show around the edge and you may be okay with that too, but I just wanna make sure that you have all the information before you get started. Um, if you have any questions about backing your embroidery um, wooden ornaments, please let me know and I'll try to help you out.